Hello, Math 151. Uh, we are looking at an airplane that is flying at an elevation of 4.1 miles on, on a horizontal flight path. That will take, take it directly, excuse me, over a radar tracking station. Uh, let X re represent the distance in miles between the radar station and the point on the ground just below the plane. If theta is increasing at the rate of 1.8 degrees per minute, and here I have to be careful because 1.8 degrees per minute, I have to convert that to radian, and speed of airplane is uh, not in minutes, it's with, you know, uh, per hour. So we have to be, I have to be careful with that too. When X is 34 miles, what is the speed of the plane? And so let me go ahead and uh, get my iPad involved. So here's also a nice drawing that is coming with this uh, prop, and that is going to be the drawing that we have has the fader right here. It has the uh, radar station right here. The airplane is coming right here, this direction. Let's see, let's pretend this is like airplane going this direction. Uh, what do you, so, and right here I have to be careful because the problem is telling us that this horizontal distance right here is x. And notice that x is decreasing. However, the speed of the airplane cannot be negative, although dx, uh, dt, the speed of uh, the change of x as a function of time is going to be negative. I have to be careful because the speed of the airplane is not negative. Uh, we are told that this is 4.1 miles. So uh, we have to be careful with conversion because d theta dt was given as 1.8 degree per minute. So we have to convert that. Well, and we are told that what is, you know, so, so find um, the opposite of dx dt, let me write it. Our job is to find opposite of dx dt, dx dt when x equals 34 miles, when x equals 34 miles. Okay, let me go to the next page. So first let's start with um, D. We are given that D theta DT equals 1.8 degrees. And I'm gonna go ahead and say that 1.8 degrees times pi over 180 degrees. And that gives me, uh, the radian, the, this, that gives me the theta dt as radian. And I'm going to go ahead and then multiply that by 60 to make that, to convert that to miles per hour. So uh, if I go 1.8, then I have second pi divided by 180. I'm doing my calculator and then times 60, uh, that gives me 1.88495559. And that is my d theta dt. So my d theta dt is now is going to be in lines. Uh, per hour. 
It was miles per minute in the beginning, miles per minute in the beginning. Uh, now I have it in miles per hour. Okay. So now, uh, looking at the picture, here's my theta. Uh, I know this is that 4.1. I know this is x. So I can say that tangent of theta equals opposite over adjacent. So 4.1 over x. So x equals 4.1 divided by tangent of theta. And since I want to take the derivative, I'm going to rewrite this as x equals 4.1 cotangent of times cotangent of theta. And so now I can claim that dx dt equals um, derivative of cotangent is minus cosecant squared. So I have a negative 4.1 cosecant squared of theta d theta dt. And we are told uh, we want to find dx dt when x is 34 miles. So when x equals 34 miles, so this is 34. Uh, this is 4.1, and let's say, let's say, call this y, and what is y? So using Pythagoras, so I have um, 4.1 squared plus 4.1 squared, and take square root of that, I am getting uh, 3, 4.246, 3, So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, say that dx dt equals dx dt equals uh, minus 4.1 Cosecant is uh, one over sine, so we know that sine is opposite over hypotenuse. Therefore, uh, cosecant is hypotenuse divided by um, opposite. So, hypotenuse we just figured out was thirty-four point two four six three one three six seven over 4.1, that is square word, times what? Uh, times the theta dt, and that was 1.88, and that approximately equals negative, so 4.1 parenthesis using my calculator. Okay, 1.88. Okay, I'm getting 539.193845 dot 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 dot. And remember that um, we said that this is dx dt, but the problem is asking for the speed of airplane, which is the opposite of that. So the speed of airplane is going to be positive, positive 539.1938. Um, and that was miles per hour. Okay, thanks.